What's up guys, it's your girl Markayla Renee and I'm back once again with another video. So today I'll be making some homemade Cajun uh -uh, Alfredo don't forget to subscribe and chicken. So and click that to watch this video. Okay, so right now I have the water ready and I'm going to put olive oil inside the water just so that the noodles will not stick to the pot. Okay, so now I'm gonna start with the chicken breast I purchased from Target just for this video because I don't know. But anyways, I am rinsing off the chicken just because I don't know what went on with this chicken before I purchased it. So yeah, just continue to watch with me. Make sure you clean your chicken before you cut, cook, etc. <laughs> Okay, so right now I'm just cutting the chicken in half into little small pieces. I'm also going to be cutting off the fat and all the little nasty looking pieces that I don't want to put in the... <laughs> just, just watch. Y'all know I don't like all that little fat looking nasty stuff. So I'm just going to put that to the side. And yeah. okay so right now i am about to cook the chicken i'm gonna add that olive oil you know you know so i'm gonna put the chicken in there the diced chicken i cut up and then i'm going to season them with slap your mama cajun seasoning onion powder and paprika and chili powder that is what I use for the chicken. I basically use like the same ingredients of what I use for everything. But I also added Old Bay as well. Uh -uh, so don't forget the garlic yeah. sauce. Oh yeah, guys. And I also added parsley just because it is cute and it makes it look a little healthy, you know, you know. So add that parsley too if you would like to. Okay, guys, so this is the option. You can either put peppers if you want to, but I am cutting up peppers because it gave my chicken flavor. It was really delicious, I swear. So if you like peppers or if you don't, I feel like you wouldn't taste it anyway. It's just giving your chicken flavor, and it also is good once you eat it all together. So if you're not a vegetable fan, um, you're going to like it anyways. You're not gonna taste it like that. So yeah, it's gonna be seasoned and sauteed, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, so now this is what the chicken is looking like. It's looking really good. You see, I added the peppers in there. It is gonna be so delicious. If you're not a vegetable fan, like I said once before, I feel like you should add it anyways. It's going to change your mind about vegetables, like for real, for real. Okay, so I'm just checking up on the noodles. Make sure you check y'all noodles, y'all. My shrimp was frozen, so I had to have that sit in some water. Mm -mm -mm. What did I tell y'all? Look at it, just being sauteed inside that oil. <laughs> okay guys so now i'm going to be making my sauce i used the entire carton of heavy whipping cream and i added tomato paste i added tomato sauce and i added entire parmesan bottle inside of this sauce as well just so it can give it that cheesy like 
cheesy, cheesy, cheesy taste because I really love cheese. So I did that, but you don't have to. It made my sauce way thicker as well and more flavorful. I also put some raw garlic in there and then I used some dried garlic. I also put slap your mama paprika, chili powder, garlic, salt, and onion powder in this as well. Okay guys, I also put balsamic vinegar in there as well, just to give it a little flavor. So you could do that as well if you have it, it is an option. It's not required. Okay guys, so I just threw the shrimp inside of the pan I used my chicken in. I did not put much seasoning inside just because the oil was already in there from the chicken and I knew that it was gonna give it flavor. I didn't want to like have it really salty so I didn't put as much seasoning on my shrimp. But like lightly. And I put slap your mama on there. And a couple more seasonings, I'm not sure, but not as much. Remember guys, you do not have to use the exact seasoning I use. You can use whatever seasoning you like for all of this, okay? Okay. <laughs> All right, now, so I added everything into the pot that the noodles were in, and now I am going to top it off with the special sauce. Super good. Super, 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 super good. <laughs>
Alright guys, these are the seasons I use. You can use whatever you want on whatever you would like. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and turn on the post notification button. If you like these videos, comment down below and I will create more. Goodbye.